Hi, this is Trisha from Lemon Paper Lab. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a gingham pattern brush in Procreate. To start off with, let's go ahead and drop a color fill layer here. Accessing the Move tool here, and then we'll go ahead and zoom out here. Make sure snapping is turned on for this here, and then you are just going to drag it to the side using those guidelines here. And then let's go ahead and change the opacity on this and then we'll bring it down to 50% opacity here. Go ahead and move that to the middle of our document here. Let's go ahead and duplicate that layer and then we'll access our move tools here. And then just clicking on the rotation icon here, let's go ahead and rotate it 90 degrees. And then we'll get rid of that there. So we have the basis of our pattern here. So we'll go ahead and click on this action icon and then under add, we are going to click on copy canvas. From here, we are going to go to the brush library. And then if you want to create a new uh, brush set, you can just hold down to add the plus icon. I'm just going to add this one to my brushes by Trisha here. And then I'm just gonna click a plus icon to add a new brush. Here we are going to go to grain. And then under texturized here, I'm gonna click to edit it. And then here in import, we are going to paste. We'll click out of that and then we just want to invert this so I'm just going to double click to invert our pattern here the dark areas block the color and white is what we will see here so I'm going to go ahead and click on done here in the green section under scale this is where you can control uh, the size of your um, pattern here so let's go ahead and try I will just do six percent for now and then here under Apple Pencil, I'm gonna bring this opacity down to none. That way there's no uh, change in opacity here. And then under Properties here, under our brush behavior, we'll go ahead and bring up our minimum size and our maximum size here. And that just makes it easier to draw. So we'll go ahead and hit Done here. So we have our brush. And if you want to give your brush a name, you'll just go to about this brush section and then you can tap. We'll bring up our keyboard here and then we'll just delete that. And then you can just give it a name. Okay, and then we'll click done there. And then let's go ahead and select a color. For this, I'm just going to choose one of my, pref my defined colors here. We'll select that there and then we can uh, turn off the visibility of these two layers we'll just create a new layer here and then you can just draw with your uh, pattern brush here and again if you want to increase the scale of it you can go back to your brush here and then go back into the grain under texturize and you can bring up the scale if you want it bigger we'll click done and then we can draw with it here and you can see your pattern brush and then if you want to combine it to a space let's go ahead and draw a circle turn off the visibility there selecting our brush let's just go ahead and find a monoline brush here under calligraphy we'll just select monoline here we'll just go ahead and draw out a circle and then if you just hold it down it will be uh, selected and then just adding a finger and it will be a, a perfect circle there. We'll just fill it with color. And then we'll drag our pattern layer above and then you can just tap to select the layer options here and then we'll just add a clipping mask. We'll turn that layer on here. And then in this case, we need to alpha lock this layer and I should have chose uh, white for our color. And then we will fill this layer here and now we can see our pattern so so pattern brushes are fun if you want to um, add a pattern to a shape here thank you for watching this video on how to create a gingham pattern brush in procreate